Hello there. Happy Own Brew Wednesday. I'm actually doing a, an Own Brew Wednesday uh, video today, which is very unlike me. Uh, but before we start, let's crack open a little bottle. I don't do many bottles, but uh, with um, doing a bit of the, uh, if you like, getting it all wrong on uh, Bearsmith. Uh, the strength's been up and up and up, and I've been adding water, which has given us three bottles of beer. And it's one of the subjects that I want to touch on today. So. With no further ado, let's crack open the beer after I've shook it as you do. Now, this what I am pouring is a Marston's Pedigree clone. <laughs> Got a little bit too much. Uh, carbonation there folks <laughs> I ain't done any bottling for donkey's years so uh, let's get me a laughing gear out of it and cheers <sighs> bit too gassy for my liking I put a spoon of sugar in that and uh, I guess a little bit too much for my liking I like it just an head really, just an head on it. And that's how it comes out in the kegs. Anyway, what's my subject today? Let's put this down. My subject today is, um, <clears throat> over the last couple of years or so where I've been doing these brews, I've been finding that uh, I keep digressing from different brews and I always come back to the same ones like the uh, the old pedigree there and also the bass uh, bitter and just simple simple beers with not too much hoppage in and I keep coming backwards to the same old recipes and I find that I really enjoy them however what I've decided to do from ends forth is to experiment in such a way that I'm just going to buy two types of hops, my favourite hops. I'm going to get East Kent Goldings and Fuggles, and that's all the hops I'm going to buy for. I've decided that I'm going to buy those only for as long as I can. So I'm, I guess I'm being a bit boring, really. But I always come back to the same old bitters, and uh, and it's like a Sunday dinner, I guess, isn't it? You uh, <laughs> a Sunday dinner. Oh, great. No, <laughs> any road up, going back on the subject, it's a bog standard and it's really, really nice, in my eyes anyway. So, what I've decided to do is to keep experimenting with Fuggles, East Kent Goldings and good old Maris Otter, and that's all I'm going to use and I'm going to use it as long as I can. And I might even try for a year of just using those three ingredients plus water plus time plus effort plus a bit of twiddling about might use a little bit of um, chocolate just to get a bit of colour and that's about it that's what I'm going to do so uh, it's going to be a bit boring watching the old fart I guess but the reason behind this is the fact that once you eat a beer that you really really like why why change it? I know people like variety. Variety is the spice of life. However, I've tasted no end of beers in my lifetime and the ones I like are the ones I like and that's what we're going to make from now on. So, so any beer reviews will be a little bit thin on the ground. But uh, yeah, now one of the reasons I quite like this this stuff is because I've made God knows how many batches of it 
and the efficiency is so good now with the kit that I've got that I can make 33 pints for five pound and six pennies. That works out at 15p a pint or half a litre, half a litre I guess. Yes, yeah, so 15p and the reason it's so cheap is number one if you buy the Maris Otter in a big bag and get the efficiency as well right up and reuse your yeast you can get a really nice pint for 15 pence a pint so what's your thoughts on that I'd like to hear your comments on this idea of just using two basic hops I'm going to twiddle about with them and put you know different boils different times different amounts but that's the idea and from this I think I shall gain a lot of experience of uh, what it is actually doing to the beers. Anyway that's my silly bloody uh, own brew Wednesday uh, over with. I've not forgotten that I've still got to do the beer smith uh, messing about with the getting the uh, if you like the figures so the match up the the brew house efficiency and the mash efficiency etc but that'll be the next one but in the meantime i thought i'd whack this up and uh, see what you thought and see if you think i'm slightly bonkers using two ops and one two th three grains at the most i guess cheers <laughs>